So, I'm out here, we're on Swepco right now. I may need to chase this one down. Anyway, I'm on Swepco right now. Throwing these digs for bass. And uh, got a 1 8 ounce Arkansas minnow jig on. Cast it up here. Got pretty good bass on right now. Yeah, I do too. Right there. Oh gosh, I thought that was your ride. Yeah. Anyway, I don't know, he's got two, two and a half pounds. Arkansas minnow. Two pound line. He's right here. Yeah, he's good fish. Probably not done yet. What you can catch on. Right there. So, Arkansas minute jig. Just a sculpin and tan head on it. Pretty good. That's what you end up with right there. There you go. So this morning, a friend of mine and I went over to Swepco Lake in Northwest Arkansas and uh, did some ultralight bass fishing. Um, we were between volleyball games. My daughter was in the conference tournament and <clears throat> we had a couple hours to kill uh, before we went back. They won, by the way, which is really cool. Oh Got it. Woo! Got it girl, okay. Congrats, Willie. Uh, anyway, went over there to throw the, the Arkansas Mena on two pound line and uh, my St. Croix PS66 LF. Uh, it's a six and a half foot light action rod. And uh, threw this jig and caught some, caught some good fish. You saw that one on the video. That largemouth uh, was just swimming it, swimming it up shallow and in behind some rocks and uh, let it drop. And you can see on this head right here, it's kind of tapered on one side and rounded on the other and that causes a, a spiraling action and so it'd fall down and <clears throat> i'd jig it almost like a trout jig i mean these are trout jigs but they catch bass too but uh we pick it up and start swimming it again and they'd eat it uh, we caught probably 25 and two hours uh, doing it and uh just fun this arkansas minute jig's got uh sculpt and olive feathers on top as you can see and then a tan bottom like that and then the head of course is uh, sculpting colored but uh and it worked it, it was a lot of fun i'll try fishing these things uh we plan to go back sometime pretty quick uh get after them again so it's a, it's a good little jig it'll it'll catch a lot of trout and caught uh, caught some really good trout on it uh, but it'll it'll catch largemouth too and then of course the other colors they'll catch smallmouth uh there'll be more on that later so anyway there you go the end